What is up guys, we are back with some more Pokemon Mystery Dungeon and we are continuing through uh, Mount Freeze, well now we're Mount Freeze Peak and hope everybody's doing well. I'm really looking forward to all the uh, all the EXP we're getting from, from this journey. We're trying to reach uh, Ninetales so we can see about having that curse uplifted and I guess stopping all the calamities that have been occurring and hopefully if it's a battle at the end that we have it's not too difficult of a battle unless it's just dialogue then we can just work our way through all that dialogue and completing the bigger journey adventure for the story which i'm trying so hard to remember uh what all like we had to do in order to go back to being able to be explorers and raising our rank and all that extra good stuff Oh, look at that, another link box. <laughs> oh my... You got a sheer cold off on me? Oh, you... Ass. <laughs> oh, and it is hailing too. Maybe that's what increased the, the accuracy for it. We, we taking no chances. We throw, we throw in that boomerang on sight. Oh, look at that. Absol got the level up. Night slide. Ooh, that's nice, actually. Cause what do you, what else do you have? You have uh, bite, pursuit. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure we don't really need pursuit like that. Yeah, I'm like, we can go to the next floor and heal up, I think. At least that's the most convenient thing. Oh, I got a level two. Look at that. 35. What? what? I'm like, we can just walk and get all that health that we, that we desire for our teammates. Why are you picking up pebbles, man? They should let you like filter through on like stuff you don't want to pick up. <laughs> let me see about eating that seed. Uh, I should have a plain seed somewhere. Yeah, there we go. Jeez. Impact? What am I going to use Giga Impact for? Oops. Oh, we need to hurry up and find the steps. Thank you. <laughs> oh, man. I'm like, if this is the battle, we're definitely not in a good position with our health. But maybe they'll actually just like max out our health just in case. We finally arrived. This is the summit, isn't it? I wonder where Ninetales is. There they are. I've spotted blades. All right, I see them. A Alakazam? It's about time we finally caught up to you. Your fugitive act dragged us all the way out here. Pipe down, Tyranitar. We can finally settle things here. I can barely contain myself. I'm itching for a fight. Renee. 
Don't think badly of me. I don't know how to show mercy. Blades. I didn't wish for this conclusion, but this too is fate. The role of a rescue team is to bring peace. We will crush you with every shred of our power. Get them. Okay, look at that run. Absol can take out uh, Alakazam, I think, though. It's nice that they actually have like a little fight, like cut scene going. On. Ooh. Okay. Okay. He wasn't ready for that for that bone right there. Let's go, boy. Cease this at once. What? Is this Nine Tails? Yep, it's Nine Tails. Nine Tails, like, what you doing here? Ah, Nine Tails. What? N Nine Tails? That's Nine Tails? The legend was real. Cease fighting at once, Alakazam. They are my guests. Tell us, Nine Tails. Who was the human that appeared in your legend? No, even before that, was that legend itself a true event? Depending on your reply, I may have no choice but to eliminate them. Whether they consider my quest to be a legend or not, I care not. However, it did happen. Many years ago, I tried to lay a curse on a human. It was then, however, that God of War, the human's partner, dashed in. It selfishly bore the full brunt of the curse meant for the human. Then. The human did a selfish thing and cowardly thing. They abandoned God of War and fled. The human eventually became a Pokemon, transformed into a Pokemon, the human. The human lives on. And that human would be... Who is the human that you speak of? Blades? You may relax, it is not you. Just now, what did you just say? Blades is not the human that appears in the legend. That is what I said. W what There's something wrong. I'm too tensed up to move. <laughs> Deep breaths. In, out, in, out, in, out. Oof. Oh, wow, fantastic. Wow, wow. That's great. I knew Blades couldn't be the one. I knew it. Blades couldn't possibly be anyone that terrible. I have another thing to say. It is true that I foretold the world's balance becoming unstable. However, that human becoming a Pokemon and the world's balance, they are not linked in any way. The cause of the natural calamities, it exists elsewhere. Hey, you. You were wrong. You were wrong to hound and harass Blades. Uh, we uh, apologize. We're sorry, we got worked up by that Gengar. No, I suspected Gengar right from the start. Blaze just doesn't look like the treacherous type. <laughs> if only that were true. But I must say, you are to be commended for prevailing through the cruel journey of discovering the truth. Impressive, Blades. <laughs> this is fantastic, I knew I wasn't wrong. Huh? Oh, but wait. Then why did Blades turn into a Pokemon? I understand that Blades isn't the human from the legend, but then how do you explain Blades becoming a Pokemon? Blades? Who are you? The ground's heaving. Qu quake? The world's crust is shifting. The natural calamities are worsening. And, the shifting of the ground, it will awaken the beast that embodies the earth. The beast that sleeps deep underground. Groudon will be awakened. What? Groudon is rising? Groudon? What is that? What's a Groudon? A legendary Pokemon that has been spoken of only in myths. It is the only Pokemon that raised the land masses and created continents. It is said to have taken to sleep after catastrophic battles with its arch enemy Kyogre. If Groudon were to get loose, that would be chaos. It must be stopped. We will go. We'll go too. No, you must remain behind. Groudon is far more powerful than any Pokemon you faced. Leave it to us. That's how it goes. You go back to your rescue team base for a well-earned rest. Don't worry about us. We didn't get our gold rank the easy way. We'll get the job done and we'll be back before you know it. Fine. We're off to quell Groudon. <laughs> and thus... Alakazam's team made their way underground to quell the awakened Groudon. 
Meanwhile, cleared of all suspicion, Blade's team put an end to their long and arduous journey and returned to their welcoming rescue team base. Finally. Oh, we got thunder too? Look at that. But look at all the money we're going to have too. I'm hoping I can get Shadow Claw though. Meanwhile, back in the Pokemon Square. <laughs> you lot. Why aren't you out there hunting down Blade's team? That's easy for you to say. It's too much for us. They say Blade's team has gone way too far out. If we went, the best we could hope for is maybe a Lapis Cave? I joined the chase, but they fled into Mount Blaze. For the life of me, I can't go on there, and that's where I lost their trail. I'm a grass type, see? Fire doesn't agree with me at all. I don't know what became of Blade's team after that, but those fugitives think they would risk Mount Blaze. They've grown up tough. I can't keep up. <laughs> what a spineless lot you are. You're so full of big talk. What about your team, Gengar? You just hang around in the square and don't do a thing. Where's Metacham, actually? Walk the talk. You guys go. We're out of the picture. Our roles to receive word about Blade's demise. <laughs> just to point at yourself that. Oh my gosh, oh my goodness. Met Metachan, what's the word? Blades. Blades? Oh, finally, we're finally rid of Blades? No, it's the opposite. Blades is back. <laughs> what did you say? H hey, over there. Blades. Th they're back. Hi everyone, we're back. Whew, we finally made it back. We've been gone for so long. Is this what I think it is? Yep, this is Pokemon Square. It feels kind of nostalgic to be back in the Square Blades. Ah, uh, who are you telling, Renee? Who are you telling? Hey, Renee. Hmm? Oh, it's you, Gengar. It's been a while. <laughs> What's with that smug confidence? I don't recognize that weirdo in the back either. <laughs> Could it be... Gengar. Everything you said was completely wrong. Blades had nothing to do with it. Blades was innocent. Oh? Uh -huh. What? Is that true? Yep, we met Ninetales and Ash. Blades isn't the human from the legend. We're back because we discovered the truth. Oh? Uh, 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 uh. Wait, wait a second. You can't be trusted yet. If you're going to make that claim, let's see some proof. P proof? That's right, some hard evidence. <laughs> Let's see some proof. Come on, out with it. Proof. We don't have any proof. <laughs> it's too bad you don't have proof. You came back for us so we could get rid of you easier. How conveniently foolish. <laughs> now, fellow Pokemon, here's your chance to get rid of Blades. <laughs> and they're like, nah, we good, bro. They said they innocent. We believe them. What's wrong, everyone? Don't you want to get rid of Blades? I, I always believed in Blades. You don't fool me. Uh? I'm out. I was saved by Blade's team before. I joined the chase with a heavy heart because of your urging, but I simply can't think of Blade being bad in any way. Uh, uh, I've heard enough, too. I believe Blade's. Yeah, that's right. Who needs proof? Uh, uh, everyone. Extra, extra. Read all about it. Yeah, tell us something, new Pelipper. What is this? It looks like a newspaper, doesn't it? Okay, I'll read it out loud. Let's see. Pokemon news. Extra. Blades innocent. Blades met with nine tails under the watchful eye of Alakazam and proved that they had nothing to do with the human in the legend. As a result, Gengar's clays were found to be malicious lies. End. <laughs> you rotten. <laughs> Run! Stop, you liar. You conned us. Welcome back. Yep, it's good to be back. We're back like we promised. <laughs> I'm so glad. Blades isn't suspected anymore. Yep, I'm glad too. We won't have to keep running from everyone anymore. Blades. We're both exhausted. I'm going to get some sleep. Our rescue team gets revived tomorrow. Let's try to do our best. 
Sounds good to me. We're back at the town. The next morning. Let's see uh, if anything interesting comes in our mailbox. Now that we're back in action. Good morning, Blaze. Did you sleep well? All right, we'll get right back into doing rescue missions. And look, Pelipper is bringing us mail already. Sorry guys, I had a yawn right there. <laughs> Let's try to do our best like we always did, Blades. And if you're wondering why I'm yawning, it's uh, 11.24 p.m. A letter from Pelipper. Yo, amigo, it's awesome you're back. I'll be delivering mail to you again. I've been looking forward to do this with my bill outstretched. I deliver tons of mail, so you better get ready, amigo. The wandering postal carrier, Pelipper. Moves have varying ranges. Moves that affect an entire room have a range of two tiles in a corridor. Moves like Growl can be used effectively in a corridor, but if the visibility is limited to just one tile, the effect will also be limited. Uh, and we can't accept any more of those quests. We're going to go check out the town and see about uh, if I can get Shadow Claw. I am so sorry. I was convinced that you had to be the one, Blades. I'm very ashamed that I treated a valuable customer with such disdain and suspicion. It isn't just you, my brother. I am guilty of the same. B brother. My brother. We both promise we will not repeat the same mistake. I will do my best to obtain even better technical machines. I hope for your continued patronage. Welcome back. Let's see, what do, what do you have for me? Uh, man. So, nothing I really want. The fairy move would have definitely been clutch. Uh, so, you can, like, see what the, what the move does and, like, how many Pokemon it affects. Maybe Bulldoze would have been nice to have on, uh, on my character instead. Let's see if anybody else, yeah, I do apologize. How could one run a bank without trusting your client? I promise to satisfy all your banking needs from now on. I hope you'll stay. Yeah, we're going to deposit all that. Yeah, I just want to show you guys like what everybody says. I was surprised that you left without your teammates in camp, but I'm glad you made it back safely. Hmm? I doubted you? Yes, just a whole lot. Sorry, camp camps, we all love camps. <laughs> okay, just for that, we going elsewhere. I expected this, I thought there had been a mistake. I mean, look at you, you don't look like the sort who can be up to no good. I'll keep looking after your things, dears, you can always count on me. And then now well, we can finally uh, store some stuff that we don't want in our inventory. Damn, I had like all these, all this stuff with me just in case like stuff went bad we of course have hella orange berries dang that was a lot of stuff I deposited there I doubted you too I do so apologize if you could wipe the slate clean I will do my best to serve your linking needs welcome alright alright yeah yeah you all feeling bad now this is the Makahita Dojo. Oh, you don't say anything? You don't, you didn't, you didn't doubt me, bro? Okay, Makahita was a real one. He's acting like nothing happened. He's like, oh, y'all left? My fault, I didn't even notice. But guys, with that said, I'm in this episode off here. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode as much as I did, especially now that we're back uh, at Pokemon Square and able to do our rescue missions again and raise our rank. But guys, make sure you leave a like for the video. Helps out the video a lot. And also subscribe to my channel. Helps the channel a lot. With that said, stay sharp. Later.